Well, this working group will represent all of the agencies, federal, state, local agencies together to try to evaluate what more can be done and develop a plan. I mean, there's an urgency now with respect to Devil's Lake. This is no longer a Devil's Lake region problem. This problem belongs to all of eastern North Dakota and part of Canada because an uncontrolled release from Devil's Lake is going to have consequences for Valley City, for Fargo, Grand Forks, Winnipeg. So uh, the issue is to look at everything that can be done uh, and do it quickly. Uh, upper basin storage, what more e exists with respect to keeping water out of the lake? Uh, the issues of trying to enhance the releases of water from the uh, state outlet and the permitting that's required on an expedited basis. Also, what other kinds of uh, outlets, uh, east side, west side, uh, could be accommodated in order to take some pressure off that lake. Uh, my judgment, I see this task force as looking at everything as quickly as is possible to evaluate what can be done to prevent an uncontrolled release from Devil's Lake, which will have very substantial consequences. We've already spent $700 million in the Devil's Lake region, but that $700 million has raised roads, raised dikes, all kinds of other issues. Now uh, that lake keeps rising, so now the question is, what do you do as we get about uh, six feet from an uncontrolled release? What do you do on a more urgent basis, not only to protect the Devil's Lake region, but to address the potential problems for other regions as well?